Hey there guys and gals, this is Barbie Figueroa with RiseMarketingAndDesign.com and thank you so much for watching my video. Today we are going to learn how to build a two page lead capture funnel. We're going to learn how to build a lead capture page and a thank you page and we're going to do it using the Builderall Pixel Perfect Builder. Now, when are you going to need a two page funnel? Well, there's going to be a lot of times that you're going to need that. If you are trying to build your email list or send people to offers, whether it's a ClickBank offer or an offer for a coaching program or an offer uh, to see a presentation video, maybe for a network marketing company, you are going to need to put that in front of a lot of people. And the only way to put that in front of a lot of people without being a slave to your business is through using a funnel. Now, a funnel is nothing more than a series of pages linked together that take a person through a process so that they can learn more about whatever it is that you're selling while it also builds your email list. So let me go ahead and show you really quickly what a two page funnel looks like. So your funnel consists of an opt in page, which is designed to capture leads and then a thank you page, which basically uh, brings closure to the transaction and then sends them maybe to a presentation or what have you. Well, in today's video, we're just going to focus on building a simple opt in page and thank you page. And then at the end of the video, if you want to learn more about how you can partner with my Builderall team where you're going to learn a lot more in depth about this stuff and how to use our tools to build your business, then keep on watching. And gals. Well, thanks again. This is Barbie Figueroa with RiseMarketingAndDesign.com. Please go ahead and take just one moment to like this video and subscribe to my channel. I would truly, truly appreciate that. Now, this video is going to be a little bit longer because I'm actually going to show you exactly how to create a lead capture page with your thank you page using the Builderall Pixel Perfect Builder. Now, if you don't know what Builderall is, Builderall is a all-in-one digital marketing platform where you can build all kinds of lead pages or sales funnels or even your own website and we have a ton of tools that will help support you in your entrepreneurial journey online without breaking the bank. So if you want to learn more about Builderall, I will have links to what Builderall is in the description box below. And if you are with Builderall or you are already aware of what Builderall is and you haven't made a decision to join yet and you'd like to partner with an elite team, then again, go ahead and take a look at the links below in the description box for more information on how to partner with me and my team rise inside the Builderall business. Okay, so let's dive into the content. Okay, so we're going to learn how to build a simple two-page funnel with the Builderall Pixel Perfect Builder. Okay, again, this is our little map that we're going to be following. It's going to be an opt-in page and a thank you page. Okay, so whether you are trying to get people to see your network marketing opportunity, or maybe you want them to learn more about your coaching program, or you're maybe you're even selling ClickBank products, but you want to build your list so that you can continue to sell to these people later on now and in the future, um, you want to go ahead and start building your list. Okay. Um, so we're going to build that and we're going to go step by step. Okay. So when you're building a funnel, you need to kind of work backwards and you're going to see what I mean in just a minute. Okay. Um, so in preparation to build your funnel, if you want to go ahead and take a screenshot, uh, you're going to need to know this process, which is again, working backwards. Um, you're going to Step one, set up your email list first. Step two, prepare your thank you page next. And then step three, prepare your lead capture page. And I'm going to show you why you have to uh, work backwards in just a second. So let's go ahead and log into my Builderall back office so that we can select a template that will help us do just that. We are in my Builderall back office and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to log in. And I'm going to go directly to the Pixel Perfect Builder. 
okay and right here you'll see that the builders are on the left hand side and there's a little flame next to drag and drop pixel perfect that's because that is our signature builder so I'm gonna go ahead and click there and I want to go ahead and take a look at a new website okay now I can go ahead and pick from all kinds of templates we've got blank pages right here uh, where you can learn how to just I mean you could just grab something right from here now if you go and you you know like if you go to sales funnels you're gonna get all the pages in that funnel and we have got different funnels to choose from we have an ebook uh, lead magnet funnel um, we've got a giveaway funnel uh, all kinds of stuff so I personally like to start with a blank page because they're a lot easier to maneuver okay so we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna just build a quick uh, capture form here to see how simple it is to do that so remember we're gonna work backwards we have to set up our email list first we have to prepare the thank you page and then prepare the lead page and you'll see why in just a second okay so I'm going to drag this this is the uh, header I'm gonna just drag this up a little bit and what I want to do is I want to add a brand new banner okay now you're gonna love our banners because they already have built-in elements into it so I could literally start and put a blue banner um, but I also have some here that are already created so let me go ahead and uh, take you down so you can see some of the uh, banner options that we have okay here's a contact form literally you can build a whole website just by clicking on the banners that you want to use so we're going to go ahead and we're going to find an opt-in banner okay see this is the top heading of your thing I can go ahead and start building a website just from here I really love this feature it's like a quick you know um, it's already designed for you and all you have to do is just modify it to your liking okay um, so let me go ahead and just find an opt-in I'm taking you down through each one so that you can see how cool all these features a lot of people don't realize that these uh, features exist inside of Builderall um, you can just go ahead and start with a blank canvas and then pick the banner that you want to work with and just drop them in in sections inside of your project okay so we got contest stuff here um, just really really cool cool things here okay so um, we have timers we have the opt-in form here um, testimonials frequently asked questions I mean can you see how you can just build something like completely from scratch okay so here's our lead capture so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to start with this one okay so basically all you have to do is change the headline free video reveals and we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna go ahead and change the font size here and we can go ahead and center it if we want we can change the color if you want okay and then I'm gonna go ahead and just bring this up a little bit And then you just go ahead and put here uh, video reveals how our team generated 100 leads in 30 days without paying for ads or any complicated marketing marketing tricks whatever okay so if you are stuck for copywriting, the cool thing about Builderall is that we also have a, um, let me go ahead and change this just a little bit bigger, just a little bit bigger, okay? We can go ahead and uh, right inside here, okay, you can go to the apps, and if you get stuck for copywriting, all you have to do is go to the script generator, okay and uh, all you have to do you have to create your avatar so that it knows who you're talking to but you can go ahead here you can go to internet marketing and you can go to funnel scripts and you can go to a squeeze squeeze page template okay and it'll give you copy for your squeeze page template okay so now it's your turn to grow your business let's go ahead and just put this here 
I'm going to copy that and I'm going to put that in here. So I'm going to go ahead and duplicate this and I'm just going to put it in here. And I'm going to go ahead and center this and I'm going to go ahead and make it just a little bit bigger. And of course you're going to edit this copy, okay? Let me go ahead and uh, stretch this out just a little bit. Okay, so let's just say we put that. And we can keep this here or we can change the image right here. So let's go ahead and select an image to change here. You can put a video, you can put um, you know anything you want. So let's go ahead and maybe just, I'll put this picture. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put this picture and I could actually animate this picture if I want to. So I want it to wobble when it appears on the page. And I can make it a little bit bigger if I want. So we are good. And here we're going to put, we care about your privacy and we'll never spam you okay and we'll put that in the center and we're good and now this is why you kind of need to have your list first because now here you know at this point I would have already had my list created you see so I have to right click here and configure so I'm gonna change this one because it is um, connected to an email actually this template is connected to an email so what I want to do is I want to actually put uh, the um, opt-in, right? Because we have an email form and we have an opt-in form, a uh, contact form and uh, add an email form. So I want to add an email form. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add an opt-in form. Okay, and I'm going to make it just a little bit smaller. Now what I can do, you see all this is squished. I can open up this little bubble thing here. That gives me more space. That opens up the banner. I'm going to bring this down and I'm going to bring this over here. Okay? That way you can put things exactly where you want them. And that's one really cool feature that Builderall has. You can put things exactly where you want them. Okay, so now I'm going to right click and it's going to say configure. See? Now you can configure with Mailing Boss, Active Campaign, MailChimp, any of these people. But we already have a built-in uh, email service, so I'm going to go ahead and connect it to Mailing Boss. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I am going to attach it to a, um, you know, to one of my lists. So I'll just go ahead and choose this one. Okay, and now what you want to do is you have to have the thank you page. You see, now I'm stuck. I need a thank you page, right? Because here, after they opt in, guess what? You need to change the URL. Where do you want them to go? So let me see if this has any pages created. See, I only have a home page. I don't have a thank you page. So this is where you have to work backwards, okay? So now what I have to do is I need to X out of this. I need to cancel, and I'm just going to go ahead and save this. I'm going to put test funnel 1, okay? And this will save my project, okay? So now what I want to do is I need to add a thank you page. So let's go ahead and add a, click over here, and we're going to add a thank you page. So we're going to add a page, and now we are going to look for a thank you page. So let me see. Um, let me look. Ah, this is the one that I want to use. Perfect. So let's go ahead and use this one. So we're going to call it thank you, and we're going to click confirm. Okay, now we want to just go ahead and move this here so that it's centered, and move this over so it's centered. Now you want to make sure that these bubbles are inside this line, okay? Here we go. Just move this over, 
and just move this over. Just drag the whole box. You see how they're separate elements? If you just click around here, you'll be able to move the whole entire box. Okay. And we'll just bring this right here. And now we have something like, congrats, you're in. Okay. So let's go ahead and save this. And we're going to save this. And now what I want to do is I want to go ahead to this page. I want to go here to this page. It's reminding me that I need to confirm my email. So let's go here to the thank you page. And what I want to do is I want to go to the address of this page. So I'll click on the little gear and I want to call it thank you. Okay. That way that is the address that's in the browser. So we're going to click save. Okay, now we're ready to connect these pages. Okay, so let's go ahead, let's go to home, and now we're going to configure that email correctly. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to change the URL. Okay, I have to start again. So now we're going to go back and configure. We're going to go to Mailing Boss. We're going to choose the list and now we're going to tell it where to go. So we want it to go to a page. And this is cool because it's all internal. You don't need to copy any links or any of that stuff. You can go here. Now you tell them, I want to go to the thank you page. You go here. And then you click here and you do the same thing. Thank you. So whether they are uh, pending subscribe or confirmed, you want them to go to the thank you page. So we're going to confirm this. Confirm this save okay and now we're gonna preview see that little thing went ta-da so there you go okay so let's test it let me go back and what I want to do now is I want to activate this funnel so I want to go ahead and put um, more options and I want to go publish and I want to make it active So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on it. So what I want to do is I want to go over here and I want to test it. And I'm just going to use a just a made up email. Lola345 at gmail.com. I got to fix this. I would have to like make that so that it's green. Okay. But those are uh, little things that you can uh, modify inside. And now it's subscribing me and boom. Now it takes me to my thank you page. And that is basically it, okay? So that's how you build a two-page funnel. Now, obviously, there's a lot of other things that you can do. You could capitalize on this right here and send them off to a presentation. Um, you can have them download a report from here. There's so many things you can do. And these are kind of the things that I dive deeper into with my own Builderall team. So if you kind of want to get on the inside with someone who understands sales funnels and can help you learn how to build your business, okay, I will have a links right below this video uh, so you can learn more about Builderall and partnering with my team and uh, you'll get access to a bunch of training, bunch of bonuses, my own uh, team funnels that I have for my team uh, so that you can you know, make money with Builderall and build your business as well. So anyway, hopefully this video was of value to you. Uh, now you know how to build a funnel inside of Builderall to help you start building your list and build your business. So if you have any questions or comments, please go ahead and leave them in the comment section below and I will do my best to answer your questions. If there's anything else I can help you with, make sure to leave your comments. And if you like this video, go ahead and like this video and subscribe to my channel and make sure to click the notification bell so that you are aware when I upload any videos to my channel. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you have any questions about Builderall or if you want to partner with my team, I'll have all those links in the description box below. So until next time, this has been Barbie figure out with risemarketinganddesign.com and I will see you on another video. Bye!